puffy hands and puffy feet are very, very common. For instance, if you go out for a walk and you swing your hands, you're going to find that your ring is tight and your hands are puffy. Uh, that's edema. That's puffiness. That's fluid that's into the tissues. Your feet at the end of the day, you may have a little difficulty uh, uh, with shoe size. Your feet may be swollen enough to really put a little pressure on your shoes. If it's not pitting edema, it's most likely not serious. Pitting edema is where you push in reasonably hard for three to five seconds and it leaves an indention. Pitting edema means there's too much fluid overload on the body. What do I mean by fluid overload? Well, number one, the heart. If the heart is not working properly and it's not moving enough blood out, then there's a back pressure that goes on and that back pressure leads into pressure in the veins and the fluid is leaked. And when fluid leaks, that's edema and pitting edema. If you can push in and there's an indention there and your doctor puts you on a diuretic, you may lose five to eight pounds. Now, most people will lose three to five pounds with a diuretic, don't use that for weight loss. The things that can cause pitting edema would number one be heart disease. It's a sign of the heart not working good enough, congestive heart failure or heart failure. Number two would be the, the liver. Uh, the liver produces protein. If there's not enough protein in the blood, then we may end up getting edema. Blood has to go through the liver. If we have cirrhosis of the liver, the blood doesn't go through, back pressure, We've got edema in the abdomen and in the feet. So it can be heart, it can be liver, or it can be the kidneys. The kidneys are responsible for getting out fluid. If they don't work well enough, you could get edema due to kidneys. So if you've got pitting edema, you need to see your doctor. He needs to find out why. Uh, it may be that you just need to cut down on salt on your diet. You need to exercise, you need to lose weight, you need to get healthier, but your doctor will work out that plan with you.